This is DLK Productions presenting my first Lego haul of 2021. And just so you guys know, this has actually been, I would say, three separate hauls, and I'm just combining it into one. So I'll just hurry and separate them out for you guys. I got one haul of just these two sets, and it was just the uh, Tatooine sets, and then we got the gunship, and then we have a f bomber. A Y Wing bomber, and that was in one set or one haul. And then we finally got this right here. We got a there, and then we got uh, the rest of these and the other Y Wing bomber all in another set. And then we actually got a house I did not put in here because it, I'm using pieces for the mock that I'm doing, the Jedi Ruin Temple. And if you guys uh, just want to check that out, uh, just click on that little link I'm going to put in, uh, in the comments, uh, and I will, that will be for week three, and I will be doing week four tomorrow, um, I'm just going to be doing another day, uh, just get a few more things done, so, we're just going to get started with it, so, the first set, the first ones I bought was actually the Tatooine sets, so, right here we got the Rancor cage, and I put all the characters up front, right here, these four. And I just put them up front. And then behind it, we have Jabba's barge. And we have these characters. And they go to the barge right there. And these are the characters I got, by the way, you guys. Um, so, yeah, and I even got another Rancor. So I have two Rancors now. And so that'll be pretty cool. I think I may use it in my mock or I may just uh, do another mock with uh, the Rancors and see where it goes from there. Um, then we move on. We got the second mock, uh, the second haul. And this was, I got three days ago. So I got the gunship and I got a Y-Wing bomber. And so I paid like... Uh, 200 bucks and this was like 80 bucks and this was like 120 bucks and I don't buy really anything new anymore um, so I buy all used Lego sets pretty much so I got the Y-Wing Bomber and I got Anakin Skywalker, Ahsoka Tano and then I got R2-D2 with that set and I did not get anyone with this set so I actually now have two sets I only have one of these uh, with the Twi'lek, and then I have the other one with the orange character, and I will hopefully be doing a 2021 uh, full clone army, uh, clone army, uh, just to show you guys, and Separatist army, uh, put down in the comments if you think I should do that, and then that's all I got first, about three days ago, and then yesterday was my final haul, and I pretty much spent all day yesterday building um, all these sets. So yesterday I got the turbo tank with the speeder and then I got another uh, Y-Wing bomber with a hyena bomber. And then I got two AT AAT tanks and then I got one uh, separatist uh, Corporal Alliance tank. And then I got one of this set, I can't remember the name off the top of my head. Um, it, I just know it's a little bit older set. I love this set. Um, so yeah, this actually with these, all of this combined and the two bags that I showed you guys before, these two bags was all together $500. That was it. So I paid 200 bucks for these two. I already said I paid like 200 bucks for these two and then a hundred bucks for the rest of it. And I also got that uh, speeder bike with the turbo tank and the hyena bomber and that bomber. And so these are all the characters. Oh, sorry. I also got Mace Windu light up, which I can show you guys. I got a Mace Windu light up character. I got Yoda and I got Anakin, Ahsoka, and I even got another R2-D2 with that bomber. And then I got every single character that you see here from these sets. And I did order on Bricklink since I got this guy yesterday and same with this guy. I ordered this guy's helmet 
so far, and I'm planning on ordering this guy's helmet uh, today. Um, so I should have them pretty soon. Um, so yeah, that is all the characters that actually came with it. I do have, I did get these two used, uh, battle droids or super battle droids, I should say, and they actually colored them, uh, which I'm a little disappointed, but I'm totally fine with it. If it really bothers me, I just won't put them in any sets anymore and I'll just have them as destroyed battle droids by Jedi or some, or by clones. And so, yeah, that was pretty much, I spent all day yesterday building all of these. Um, they can't, I would say 98%, uh, that was 98% complete. This was 100%, 100%, 100, 100%. Uh, this was 100%. This one, I would say 99 because it didn't have any of the stickers. As you guys can see, that one had no stickers on it. And then I, ha I left a droid back there just to keep an eye out in the back. And then this was 100%. That was 100%. And then this one, I would say, is like 97%. It was missing a few pieces, but I had them, so I just put them in that were just lying around. And I ordered them on Pick-A-Brick. So now I have extras, I guess you'd say. And so this set is... I forgot the name of it, I just know it is uh, from the Aquatic Agents era, and this uh, actually is a, one of the coolest sets I have found in a, a long time, uh, f as I find in age-wise. Uh, these are all like 2008 and forward, and this is after, or before 2008 I should say, and so... Yeah, and I got four characters. I got an agent, and he actually has some hair and a scuba tank in the back. And then I got two guards, and then I got the commander, you'd say, commander. And so, yeah, uh, let me know if you guys want me to do any reviews. As I said before, I will be doing this year a Lego Star Wars Republic and Separatist uh, Altogether Armies. So we will have, I'll showcase every single uh, droid, clone, and every vehicle that I have in my collection so far. And I will see you guys in the next video. Have a good day.